The following is for mature audiences only. Viewer discretion is advised. Welcome back, guys. Our playthrough of Alan Wake 2. Okay, so I think now we have to take on Thornton and Mulligan. It's adjusting the volume here. All right. Those two have made off with the clicker. We've taken down this, like, really strong, powerful, whatever he is, uh, taken that was inside here. There's a handful of objects we have to get as well to interact with the float outside. We got the fuse, though, so I think it's probably a good, a good point for us to start this thing. We have to knock all those out. I don't really know where everything else is. So this is the Coscula Brothers Parade float. Looks like only four pieces are missing. The mask is the only one without a location listed. Hmm. It looks like it's trying to say something here. But okay, so we walked over here before, but this wasn't something we could look at, but now we can. Shop. Easy. Perfect. I can't make out what it says. Espresso Express. Got it. Fair trade fun zone. Okay, let's see. What does that say? I wish I could zoom in more. Oh, I can. It scribbled out really well, but I'm wondering if... There's an I in the name. Do you see that? There's a blue dot right there. So there's something there. Let's see. What would have an I in it? Fair trade fun zone post office. Yeah, I think it might be it's some sort of office. Retirement home. Hmm. Office of some sort. Station, maybe. You could probably fit an I, O, and an N in there. Office. Let's see. Espresso gift shop. Okay, we haven't gone to the actual lighthouse, though. So we're going to knock this out, but we're going to go to the lighthouse first. Only because I just... I don't know. I feel like there might be something interesting there. We haven't really had a need to go up there yet, but I think that's... If I had to guess, since... Bolt cutters weren't in here. Oh, we got something to look at. Um, whatever, I'm just gonna click one. What is this one? The list of list mentions I can set. Yeah, I know where that's at. Is missing a soundtrack? Should the characters be moving? The float killer isn't wearing a mask. Maybe he needs one. I figured out what the float is missing. Okay. I don't know if there's anything related to the lighthouse that something is going to pop up later. It would make sense. But... I was gonna check it out before and I just didn't get around to it. Figure, why not do it now? Wait a second. Is it possible that the trailer park? That's it. We'll take another look at the trailer park in a minute, but first we're going to go up to the lighthouse. I just want to see if there's anything there. It's not too far. Basically just sidestepping right now. Save spot, which means we might run into trouble. Come on, save that. <sighs> A third time? All right. Is there anything else in here? Shoebox. No page, though. Okay. Well, 
There's a threat up here. Has to be. A wolf. No. It's a taken of another kind, though. There he is. There's a second one. There's two of them. Oh, shit. Last three employees. She's up there now. God, she's fast as hell. Jesus. Okay, I think that's all of them. Yeah. God damn it. Yeah, that's all nine. That was the last three. That would have been useful earlier. Shit, then I lost so much ammo. God. Those guys took a beating. Did they drop anything? Shit. I literally just killed the entire staff of Coffee World. <laughs> okay, let's do some looking around, see if there's anything valuable here. I feel like we should probably be safe for a little bit. There's a rhyme over here. I never understood these. An old watcher of the sea before his demise cursed the waters that ruined his eyes, so he played a trick on the ocean deep, the waves to fight and havoc to wreak. And in doing that wrong, lost his soul's song. I don't know. None of these really make any sense. It must be a different doll. I wouldn't think any of these would work. Unless there's a doll nearby. Is there any chance of another doll here? If there are. None of them are here. But what do you know? Trickster doll. Wise elder doll. These ones also don't really make sense. Wise Elder, maybe. 
Other has nothing to do with it. Trickster doesn't really seem to have anything to do with it. Well, it's none of those. Need the key. Yeah, none of these will work. Okay. Well, at least we took out the three pains in the ass over here. Too bad there's not, like, any real items that I can benefit from. Page fragments. Well, we got a little bit from that, like, birdhouse thing, but... I take a look at this gazebo real quick. Thank God. I'm stuck. Okay. You can pick up the Fuck, that scared me. Dog sweaters at the Sunday market. And while you're there, Go visit Wendy Davis and grab some of our sponsor's famous beef jerky. Up next, we've got Deer Fest. Oh, hold on now. We have, we have a call coming in. Which, which button is that? Hello? Uh, wrong line. Oh, hold on. Uh, hello? Hello? You're on with Pat Main. Yeah. Gil Davis here. What a pleasant surprise. We have Gil Davis on the line from our lovely sponsor, Davis Family Beef Jerky. Gil, any thoughts on those crochet dog sweaters? You need to stop. <laughs> What's that? Just stop. Whatever this is you're doing, stop. Well, I'm not sure I understand, Gil. There's no such thing as Davis Family Beef Jerky. I don't sell beef jerky. I've never made beef jerky. I don't particularly like beef jerky. I'm getting crazy phone calls for jerky orders, day and night. You got confused old ladies all over this goddamn town on the hunt for imaginary beef jerky, asking for insane flavors like hickory teriyaki, which clearly isn't a thing. Ah, uh, if you don't sell beef jerky, then somebody needs to tell your lovely wife, Wendy, because she's out there at the market every Sunday selling it. Wendy is dead, Pat. No, that's, that's, that's not right. I, I just saw Wendy at the, at the market last weekend. Wendy went missing 13 years ago, Pat. They found her body. She's dead. We're trying to make peace with that, and you're making it so much harder with all this goddamn beef jerky bullshit. No, that's, that's just not true. She's there. Every weekend, I see her there. This joke's gone far enough. Now go get Wendy on the line so we can have a laugh about this. <laughs> She's fucking dead, Pat. Stop. Gil? Uh, I, I, I think we're out of time. Uh, dog sweaters, Sunday market. And, yeah, Pat Main signing off. Damn, these are all, like, super interesting. Jesus Christ. My first watery visit. I'm staying near the lighthouse trailer park at a nice little spot just off the road. It's very quiet here during the day. At night, not so much. I've never been too nervous and can sleep through an earthquake, but here... I don't know, something just feels off. The animals act weird. They're restless at night, making weird noises and running away. And I could swear I hear someone moving around circling. I'm gonna give it one more night and then move on. I think we saw this before, or like a reference to this when we first started the game. There was like a little spot that had a note like that too. So here's the trailer park. I don't know if there's anything down here that we need to like interact with or do but okay yeah that's where we saved it came through here okay yeah we can 
cut through. Damn, dude. Wendy was gone that long. Okay, I'm gonna do a quick little save so we can move on. The mask, though. I feel like the mask is in the trailer park, so I'm actually gonna look at that, too. Let's go see if we can find it. I just, I don't know. The way that note was written, it just looked like... Actually, hold on. I've got a little yellow marker. I want to see what that's... What that requires real quick. The materials listed for the parade float mention a mask. Where is it? Poor Mocha Moose. He never failed to amuse me. No, we know, Ilmo. There is such a thing as too much coffee. Mocha will live on in a place of honor. He lost his head. Mulligan and Thornton had one job. Mulligan and Thornton must know where the Moose Skull Mask is. I just dropped my water bottle over myself. God damn it. That's right. Desk's not a mess, but uh, my pants are. So I'm going to sit here in my wet pants now because I'm too lazy to dry this out. All right, we got all that. God damn it. I'm always afraid to do that. Anytime, like... Oh, the deputies. I'm, like, recording, and I've got a drink here. I'm like, I'm going to spill someday. I'm going to spill someday, and I'm going to get it all over my keys. But no. My keys, uh... My keyboard, my mouse, everything's safe, but... God damn it. Son Mouse of a bitch. Missing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where is it? The dead brought back to life. The crown of the Grand Master. Moose stink is never a mistake. Just get it fucking done. They know where it is. I know they know. Where is the mask? Go ahead and bleach it. We'll bow to him. The mall of the crown we will. Child ah. choose mall. Oh well. That's a good shot. The moose mask Perfect. is at the Huatari well in Coffee World. Perfect. Okay. We're good there. I saw something. Like I did in Cauldron Lake. The well. Here in Coffee World. I know the Moose Skull will be there. Yeah, we're gonna need to save multiple times for sure, because I'm gonna get freaking stomped. I can feel it. Okay, let's go. The mask will probably go after last. I don't know if we can, like, go at it sooner. So what is that? Just a package that we can't even. Whatever. Okay. Back to Coffee World. Wasn't that much water. It's a little bit. I'll change my pants in a minute. <laughs> Alright. Okay, so the first thing is the fuse situation. It's here. I knew it would be. Oh shit. I made them show me. I guess that could be first. I don't want to do that run again. I'm going to do... Wait, what is that? Well, whatever that is, we don't need to do that yet. I'm going to go ahead and do a quick save here. Oh, weird. This must be a glitch, another one. Dude, this game is riddled with bugs. It's starting to get on my nerves a little bit. All the weird, like, obstructions that are showing up. For no reason. Some of them you can get past, some of them you can't. Alright, do I have... Uh, what's in the shoebox? Bolt. I am gonna take that. Throwable gas can or detonate's been shot. I'm going to take this because I have a feeling it might do some major damage. How big is it? Okay, it's not that big. This one might be necessary against whatever pops out of the well. See, just run right through it. Hopefully we can find the uh, 
bolt cutters soon. I don't know where they would be. All right, we're going to fight something powerful. I can feel this. Now I need to bring the mass to the float. That, what? That was it? They were making it sound like this was going to be a huge... Okay. The moose skull goes here, obviously. Okay. I'm not going fucking near that thing again. All right. The fuse needs to go to... Actually, wait, we can get that tape. So we killed everybody in, in here, but there was also wolves before. So, oh, that's the exit. So I have to be careful. There can still be something nasty here. Thing. Okay. I feel like an asshole for killing everybody in, in the uh, in the thing. In Coffee World. The moose mask appeared on the well. Actually, wait. We got more case. More case stuff here. What is that? Mother doll uses all rhyme puzzle. Okay. Wish I could see this shit. Here we go. dangers there are around here, but... Oh, not the yellow thing. It wasn't that. We already dealt with that. This thing. Thank God. Okay. there was anything else in this thing that I needed. Where is that other attraction? a big, well, I thought it was a big person. They looked huge. It scared the shit out of me, too. Uh, the knife. Some creepy laughing for atmosphere. God, this game freaks me out. Okay. done. The 
game gets so weird and choppy sometimes. I wonder how often there's going to be a threat that comes out of here. Okay, this was one, I think, that we had to do. The fuse goes in the box over here. that work is there like a yeah there's a cart that's missing okay I see the timing on this is gonna be weird because it doesn't stop right when you click I don't think JK doing down here Just to be safe. Wait, what is this one? The killing of Monica Thompson was a terrible mistake. Thornton blamed Mulligan's itchy trigger finger. Mulligan blamed Thornton's shitty pastrami sandwich. <laughs> they only agreed it wasn't their fault. No one will find her corpse. We'll hide it. They fed the body to the maw of a crumbling well, like the murderous Huatari brothers did long ago. Oh, shit. They lied to everyone. The word would never get out. But a secret like this doesn't die. It grew inside them, like cancer. The darkness taking over, filling the shape of them. Huh. What is Saga fights in the at taken at the work? Okay. Got it. Okay, so I think we read all those. We killed whoever they dropped down there. That must have been Monica. Fuck, I hate that. A little something to get those arms moving. Okay, another safety save. Alright, then lastly, we need the knife. Goal, get the clicker for Mulligan, complete the overlap ritual. Cold Motor, Cold Lake, Fact Fiction. Okay. The P 
puke in the gift shop. Okay. Save that. that. Now what are the chances though of more taken showing up? Kill all the staff, that one that just popped up. We had a wolf or two that we dealt with. Goes a knife. Not that. That's I it. I guess a toy knife will do. light thing didn't work it's like bugging out I'm gonna leave it and see if it stops ah, it's still following me that noise <sighs> yeah I don't know man every update this game gets just more and more buggy there's another update I think it's pending on this one I'll have to take a look at it see the body's gone but it's still annoying as shit there we go. Okay, Saga. Let's get the clicker from these assholes. Oh, it's back. All right. Okay. Well, I'll run the update and everything. It's a good point for us to uh, stop anyway. Perfect timing. Hopefully we get down there and then it goes away. Maybe if I restart the game, it'll fix stuff. But anyway, thank you guys for watching this episode of Alan Wake 2. We'll continue right here where we left off in the next one where we'll take on Thornton and Mulligan. If you enjoyed this episode, though, you can share your love by hitting the like button. Do not forget to subscribe. Any feedback for me, leave in the comment section. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Also, don't forget to take a look at the description box. There's some links that might be of interest to you, one of which is a link to the Mark and I community Discord server. If you want to be part of that group, you can chat with me directly. Otherwise, just know I appreciate you and your time and hope to see you and me continue with more of our playthrough of Alan Wake 2. All right, guys, that's it for me. Take care, be well. See you next time.